Jeremy Clarkson has taken to Twitter to reignite the backlash he faced after he tweeted about the heat wave in France last week. The owner of Diddley's Squat Farm, 62, sparked a frenzy amongst his followers after claiming that one of his pigs had died as a result of the scorching temperatures, as he declared global warming is over. In view of his 7.7 .7 million followers, the Clarkson's Farm star reignited the backlash he faced following his tweet about the heat away three days ago. The Grand Tour presenter wrote, thankfully, the global warming is now over but tragically, its brief visit took the life of my big pig. R.I.P. Pig Jeremy's tweet comes as temperatures return to the mid-twenties after reaching 40 degrees in some parts of the country yesterday, resulting in devastating wildfires. Following his post, the star's social media following flocked to the comments to take issue with what has shared. Twitter user at ENSMI1470431919 replied, Good joke. That the people who lost their homes to fires are laughing their heads off. While a Joshua 661274447 commented, Jeremy Mate, I'm pretty sure global warming is still here. Climate isn't the same as weather, global warming isn't over, at Stardust 6794 hit back at the star. At Cheryl Bolton added, perhaps you will realize how serious this is then. How would you like it if your land was on fire and you are struggling to harvest enough food to keep your animals fed or winter, let alone anything else? I feel sorry for the proper farmers, they ended their comment. It comes days after the Top Gear star faced backlash as he controversially weighed in on the heat wave, after comparing British concerns about the heat to the attitude from the public in France. He tweeted, It's very hot in the south of France but so far as I know, there's no DEFCON 8 level 3 killer death heat wave warning in place. His comments came as the UK was set to see its biggest heat wave of the summer so far with London temperatures topping that of the Sahara Desert. Despite the Met Office issuing amber and red alerts, warning of potential serious illness or danger to life, Jeremy made it clear he wasn't too impressed with the public's reaction. The presenter took to Twitter yesterday to claim that France was much more calm in handling the heat. In another tweet he wrote, I've spent my life working in extreme heat and we survive by having a beer under a tree. Climate change is real. Drink more beer. However, like the UK, France has also been hit by extreme weather and has its own heat warnings in place. Temperatures have soared to the mid-40s in some regions of the country, with the southwest being badly hit. Wildfires spread over 11,000 hectares of the Gironde region and resulted in over 14,000 people being evacuated from their homes. The government issued red alerts for a few regions, as over 1,200 firefights attempted to get the blazes under control.